I had never seen this before, ever in my entire life. We were hungry. We were praying for fire. Mary Kay will tell it. Dan and and and, and Chuck were at their house praying for fire. We we the Holy Spirit, but we want the fire. Not even know. I didn't even know about the fire. And and she came up and prophesied at uh, at the firestorm in Harrisburg. The Quakers are coming back to Pennsylvania. The Quakers are coming back. And it was supposed to be Lou Engel talking, and I was so disappointed because <laughs> I wanted to see Lou Engel, and I didn't know who she was. Well, the, she comes up little, and she, she comes up with like a real like inward, you know, like, and her lips start shaking. I'm like, oh my God, what's going to happen? <laughs> she came right over and prophesied that, right over, like I was sitting right there, right over top of me. The Quakers are coming back. I had it recorded on my phone. Now, I had a meeting uh, this group had a meeting like a week after that, and all I did was play the recording of your prophecy over and over and over again. So in the room was her prophesying, the Quakers are coming. And I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just saying, I believe it. I believe it. I believe it. I believe it. And Esther was there, and Esther was prophesying. And all of a sudden, I could hear her voice in, in the back. I could hear it. All of a sudden, my body flipped up off the ground, flew, you saw, who else was there? Nick and Trudy. Oh Esther was there, Nick and Trudy were there. Huh, was it scary? Oh my God. It was scary. My body f flipped up off the ground. I began to scream. I was horrified. And I shook and I rolled for three hours from one side of the room. I, could, I couldn't even get near anybody because if anyone would get near me to touch me, it would happen again and I would just begin to shake. Huh? Rug burns. I pulled every muscle in my body. There was so much fire. I, I, I sweat through all my clothes. It was horrifying. I kept saying to the young, there was some young people. I, was, I called you on the way home. I, I'm still shaking. I couldn't drive. I had to pull over. The computer guy was in my house whenever I got home. And I said the word Jesus and I started shaking. <laughs> I couldn't even say the name of Jesus without shaking for a really long time. It was so powerful. It was so powerful. Why am I telling all this? Well, it's going gonna, it's gonna to happen. It's transferable. They carry it. They carry the spirit of prophecy. And it's going to happen to some of you today. Today. Right now. But you know what? That prophesying power, that spirit of the Lord that came on me, I was completely, I was delivered, set free from pornography. Different things that I was like fasting for. And the Lord completely washed me clean, set me, filled me with fire, with, pro with witnessing power. Power to witness. Power to take the gospel.